welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be checking out the new tack and Britless Bridal that just came out and a lot more. So let's get straight into the video. Okay guys, so here I am at the uh, Hackmore's shop. And as you can see, here are all these bridles. And this is actually my first time and I actually love them so much. And oh my gosh, probably this one might be my favorite. I don't know. So I'm going to zoom in right now, as you can see, so that you guys can see the prices a little bit more easier. And so right here, so this one, my favorite one, is 5,000 star coins. Actually, all of them, of the bridles are 5,000 star coins, except this one right here. So, this one is actually a bit more simple than the rest of the ones, but I still think it's okay. But let's go on to the prices. So, this one right here has no stats, but it has 2,500 shillings. And then the rest of them have stats, and they're all 5,000 shillings. So, that is like okay price which i'm really good like i'm happy that it's not too expensive i was expecting a bit more expensive but it's great and then the saddle with no stats is 5500 and then the, the more expensive saddle which is exactly 10,000 star coins so i don't like that it's 10,000 star coins it's just if there was non-maximum shillings then that would be more okay but because there is a maximum or limited shillings, it's just not really fair. And in star coins, that is 110. So, but this one does have actually a lot more stats, but still, it is way too expensive. And that goes with the rest of the saddles. And just these two right here are different prices. Okay, so now let's go on to the saddle pads. So this one right here, I think is a cheap one and it's actually really cool I really like it it's 4,500 4, shillings and 45 star coins so that's still a good price I will admit and then the rest of the saddle pads are 90 and 9,000 shillings so that's so much actually I don't think it's worth it honestly I don't think it's worth it so I wouldn't really suggest it um, or I would just recommend putting the price down because that's just too expensive so now let's go on to the leg wraps okay so the leg wraps right here so these three right here are 3,000 shillings or 330 um, star coins so they're actually not a bad price most of them are lots of actually um leg wraps are way more expensive than this so i'm actually really happy with this price and then this one for the cheaper one is 2050 and 25 star coins so that's actually not a bad price but i'd still recommend i like these ones these ones are probably my favorite out of them all i would say and out of the saddle pads, I would probably say this one would be my favorite. And out of the saddles, I would probably say, hmm, let me see, this one's a tough. I would say maybe this one. This, all right, now I'm gonna buy them. And I don't know which one to pick, so I'll be right back when I decide which one I want. Okay guys, so I actually decided and I'm not going to be getting any of the saddles just because I actually have lots of saddles and I don't need any more. And I might be getting two of these or this one and this leg wrap. So I don't know which one to pick. So. I'm going to be right back with you guys. Yeah, so I just decided, and I'm actually going to be buying these two and the leg wraps, these ones right here. And I'm 
and then when I save up enough star um, shillings, I'll get this saddle right here. So until then, I'm not going to buy that, but that will be maybe in an upcoming video. I don't know. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and buy them right now. Okay, guys. So I calculated wrong and I didn't have enough and I didn't have enough shillings. So this is actually really cool, guys. I really like it. Oh, that looks so realistic though. Dude. It looks like um you're like leading like with the halter, you know? So this is like a really good realistic role play. So I might be doing a realistic role play, guys, in the future. Okay, so there's actually one more thing that I need to mention is, so the Star Stables made a, a horse generator, and I think I'm pronouncing that right, if I'm not, um, I'm sorry, but uh, when what that does is, so you can only put this uh, Britless Bridle um, only on certain horses, so... Uh, if it's not one of these uh, horses that right now I'm going to put on the screen, if it's not none of these, you cannot put this um, Britless Bridle on. So these are the only ones that, uh, only these breeds you can uh, put on the Britless Bridle or on your horse. And right now I'm going to show you what it does when... Um, so one of the Frisians, the Frisians are actually in Generator 2, so it, you cannot put it, uh, the Britless Bridle on. So this is what it says when, uh, you don't uh, have a horse that isn't in Generator 3. Okay, so I know this is not necessary, but I want to show you guys some clips of the Britless Bridle on my horse. So, uh, I'll show you guys right now. Okay guys, so I have to check on one last thing before we finish this video, and that's at the bone shop, and SSO released some boots, and they're actually really cool, I actually, um, they look really nice, and what's also really good about them is that they actually have stats, so that's really cool, and remember, this bonus shop is only for lifetime star riders, so if you're not a star rider, then I unfortunately you will not be able to get this item so let me go back okay I'm gonna go on my inventory and I'm gonna equip them on me I'm gonna go in photo mode too and I'll zoom in just so that you guys can see uh, what I'm talking about and they're really nice they're very um, they look very comfortable um, and all that kind of stuff so um these are not my type of boots so I don't think you'll see me really ride them very often but they are very well made and I think that is, that is very good and yeah they did a great job on that I'm actually gonna equip my shoes back on so yeah okay guys I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did please like and subscribe to my channel so in a couple of weeks SSO will be bringing out some halters which I'm so excited uh, I'll pop up right now on the screen and as you guys can see uh, you guys can pause the video and you can read it if you like 
and yeah so I'm really excited so stay tuned for that video and yeah so I'll see you guys on Saturday bye Okay, so um, to have this um, bridal, I mean, I mean, uh, Britless bridal, you need um, generation, a generation. Is it generator or is it generation? Give me one moment. Okay, so I just looked it up, and it's um, generation. Generator. Is there a D in there? Um, give me one. Never mind, uh, it's generation. But I don't, why is it generation? I don't get it. Um, okay, well, um, um, I'm gonna take, t I'm gonna do take. Okay, so if I go on the Frisian horse and I go on my inventory and grab my bridle that's not it where is oh it's right there oopsies uh it says oh, what am I... it says you can't equip this item on this breed um i don't think it's fair this is generation let me check which generation this is on Okay, so this is generation two. So okay. So you can't ride on. You can only ride. Oh my gosh, I'm getting confused. Okay, so yeah, let's get straight into the video. Okay. It's just like, I believe that can fly. That's not how it goes. You're not supposed to be crashing. Oh. Great. Okay, where is the bonus shop? Or what is it called? Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I think it's a more lab. No, it has to be here. Um. Where? Where do I find Heck. Um, it can't be there. Where do I find the? Where do I find the British bridles? Um, I'm confused. Okay. Um. Okay, I doubt this is it. But Hackamores. What in the world is that name? Oh, well, great. Um, okay. Okay, so we're here at the Hackamores shop, and let's go check out the Britless Bridles. <laughs> 